I think for art people, one and main thing is to be truthful to himself and uh, to the art what he's doing. It doesn't matter, he's a sculptor, he's a uh, painter, it doesn't matter. He must be very truthful and uh, to feel inside the freedom he, and not to be afraid, another main thing. The Georgian artist Rusadan Petvayasvili was born in Tbilisi in 1968, but so precocious was her talent that she has now been exhibiting for over 40 years, having started drawing when she was only 20 months old. Her vibrant paintings, stunningly composed and seemingly drawn from her own internal mythological landscape, are created with a free line and no preparative sketches on a variety of surfaces, including silk. Petvayashvili's artistic family provided an upbringing unhindered by Soviet-era restrictions, and as word of her talent spread, she was invited to exhibit solo in Moscow, London and Paris. Her work quickly featured in galleries and museums and the private collections of the rich and influential. A large number of books have used her illustrations, including The National Fairy Tales of Georgia and The Night in the Panther's Skin, and she has headed up work on an illustrated old Georgian gospel of St. Matthew. Rusadan hosted us in her inspirational studio. The life is very com complex and very complicated and the relationship between people, between the persons are very complex and very complicated. So the, uh, the paint on my, in my paintings are everything, but, is, but there are a little bit in parables, not exact things, but just uh, to say with uh, fair tales. I love my city, of course, and my country and my city where I've grown up and uh, lived all my life. And this is my base. I'm, I love very much Nitsheta, the another city much more older than Tbilisi and uh, much more important than Tbilisi. Um, and uh, I, I would say the Zimtsheta uh, really is my really is very helpful for me uh, to to create to to feel myself cozy to feel myself free. I was two years old when I when I started to paint, and since that time. Uh, I, I'm, I'm pa I paint and paint with them. and so it was step by step um, just um, created the style. It's not artificial style uh, which are made afterwards when I was already grown up. No, it was step by step just created such a style and I, I should say that it's not a style for me. It's just very, very natural. Uh, natural expression of my feelings uh, on my thoughts. Uh, main thing, uh, it is uh, all, all the paintings are made in the process uh, or spontaneously without any preliminary works or without any sketches and the line is the main and leading in my paintings even it doesn't matter if it's is it the watercolor, uh, silk paint, uh, oil paint, on the line is leading and main and uh, without any without cutting and, uh, before i before i start the paint before i start the to make them painting i have 100 percent of concentration of myself. I need the 100 percent concentration because uh, 
the line must be not cut it. So when I'm making the hand, it must be a hand without with one line and without any cutting the line. So it's uh, it's very important for me uh, to to be gathered and not to be scattered. And my thoughts must be very kind, and I myself must be very harmonically to to the world. Uh, to to be able to create. It was very important for me uh, to create, to, to paint, because it, it was as necessary as to breathe or as to have the water.